where this generation of teens no longer cares. School isn't important, and their future doesn't matter. School is more of a fashion show than a learning environment, more judgmental than fundamental. As soon as you walk through the front gate, somebody is staring you up and down. If you're not wearing the nicest shoes, the flyest clothes, driving the hottest car, or don't have 22 inches. <laughs> if your face ain't deep, eyebrows not on fleek, you probably should have just stayed home. The teens of 2016 focus is now more on brands. Meanwhile, the fate of their future relies in their hands. And let's not forget how everybody try to get the teeth. Screenshot in a group text talking about how Mike and Rachel broke up and Daisy got caught up. <clears throat> and everybody try to throw shade. But who really catching it is a grave. Oh, yeah. Instead of worrying about A's and B's, you're more worried about Twitter B. And meanwhile, you in the courtyard fighting, you probably should be preparing for your ACT writing. Okay. Yeah. Social media has taken over. Your likes, retweets, and views shouldn't define you. We have way more serious problems in this world. Aren't y'all tired of classmates dying, guns firing, parents crying, bullets flying? Crime after crime after crime committed by our teens. And why are we concerned about our health? when HIV and STDs are being passed around like weed. And let's not even count the team pregnancy. Stop trying to be cool. Realize that you do need school. With dropout rates increasing and graduation rates decreasing, this is serious. Yes. You think it's all fun and games until it's time to walk across that stage, but instead, you're seeing Dr. Brennan next year. Let's have a great day here in Buck Nation. You have to be a story of the high school. Once you finish, you open a whole new world that's new. Team of 2016, open your eyes and see the view. We have to make a change and make one quick, because sooner or later, this generation won't exist.